After Obama attacks black GOP candidate, his brutal reply sends Barack scrambling. Sin Tim Scott is one of a few black Republicans serving in Congress. And he made waves in the GOP primaries by announcing a run for president. I don't have to tell you how much Democrats dislike black conservatives. The left has spent years telling black people they have to support the Democratic Party. So, whenever a black American comes out as a conservative, Democrats go out of their way to attack them. Former President Barack Obama has stayed relatively silent over recent elections. I guess he's been too busy soaking up all that Netflix money. But when a black Republican senator joined the presidential race, Obama decided to get dirty. From Fox News, I'm not being cynical about Tim Scott individually, but I am maybe suggesting the rhetoric of can't we all get along. That has to be undergirded with an honest accounting of our past and our present. Obama went on to argue that candidates must address racial disparities in the justice system and elsewhere if they want to be taken seriously when they talk about American unity. Obama seems to think that a black candidate can't run for office without making everything about race. Just like every other Democrat, Obama looks at America through the lens of racism, unable to see it any other way. And he criticized Tim Scott, a black man who refuses to think that way. So, Scott fired back with a powerful message. From Twitter, let us not forget we are a land of opportunity, not a land of oppression. Democrats deny our progress to protect their power. The left wants you to believe faith in America is a fraud and progress in our nation is a myth. The truth of MY life disproves the lies of the radical left. We live in a country where little black and brown boys and girls can be president of the United States. The truth is we've had one and the good news is we will have another. Let us not forget we are a land of opportunity, not a land of oppression. Democrats deny our progress to protect their power. The left wants you to believe faith in America is a fraud and progress in our nation is a myth. Since Scott blasted Obama's race-based criticisms out of the water. Obama's very success, Scott says, disproves the Democrats' claim that everything in this country is about race. Scott said America is a land of opportunity, not oppression. He dismissed Obama's claim that a black candidate has to keep harping on the sins of the past. Scott said his own life disproves the lies of the radical left that black people can't succeed in this country. Democrats don't seem to want black Americans to think they can succeed. The left is constantly telling them that they are victims and their only hope is to vote Democrat. How convenient. But Scott is proof that a black person can succeed in this country, becoming a senator and presidential candidate, without marching to the left's tune. 